In this video, I'll teach you how to teach a live online lesson with a student using Skype so that you can see both your student and the off-to-class lesson material together at the same time in a way that works perfectly. Here's how to set it up. This video is for teachers who need to teach online. Off to Class runs in conjunction with a second application. Off to Class for student management and content and a video conferencing system. You and your students will be logged in to Off to Class to interact with the lesson content, but you'll also be using Skype to see and speak to your student during the live lesson. Today's video will show you how to use Off to Class with Skype. You can see that I have two windows open. On the left side is my teacher's screen. On the right side is my student's screen. In this video demonstration, the teacher and the student are in different places. I'm just showing you what they each will see at the same time to demonstrate how to use Off to Class and Skype together. The first thing that the teacher will do is select a lesson and enroll a student. At this time, the student will be also logging in to offtoclass.com since my student knows that it's time for the lesson. When it's time for the lesson, I'll go to my Skype window and I'll place a video call to my student, sending a quick message to confirm that my student is ready. Now that it's ringing, I can see myself, and once my student answers, I'll see my student in the larger Skype window, and I'll see myself in the corner. Now, by clicking the Minimize button, Minimize is the horizontal line in the yellow circle on a Mac at the top left of the Skype window, or it's the horizontal line that looks like an underscore at the top right of the window on a Windows machine. And by clicking Minimize, it will make the Skype window smaller and it will allow the Skype window to float on top of every other window. So by minimizing Skype, I can now position my student's video feed anywhere that works for me so that I can see both my student and the off to class content. And my student can position his Skype window so that he can see me as well as the off to class content. Now, my student can click the green Join Lesson button since he is logged in to Off to Class and it will take him to the Off to Class classroom that I have opened. Once the student joins the classroom, the classroom chat opens and we can use this to chat with each other. Now that my student is here in the live lesson with me, and since we're both logged in to Off to Class, we can take advantage of all the features of the Off to Class classroom. My teacher notes are visible to the left of the lesson content, which my student cannot see. And when I switch slides, they're automatically synced to the student's side. We can also use the interactive lesson tools, for example, the pen and the text box, and any edits that I make are instantly reflected on the student side and vice versa. This is especially useful when we want to look at any gap fills. I can model one for my student and it will appear immediately on his screen, and then my student can complete the rest of the gap fills and they will be reflected immediately on my screen. When the lesson is finished, I can click on the purple Close Classroom button, and then I will have the choice to assign this student homework. And then when I want to end the lesson, I can just hang up on Skype. 
In this way, you can teach your students on Skype and still get the full benefit of all the interactivity of off to class.